Executive Director of Women for Action, Managing Editor of Women for Action Magazine. This is a book response on Lean In Ohio 100 Women Archives, a keepsake of interviews with women trailblazers, which is actually authored by me. So before I go into talking about the book, I wanted you to know a little bit about, about Lean In, which is a term that originated from another book called Lean In Women Work and the Will to Lead, a bestseller by Sheryl Sandberg, the Chief Operating Officer of Facebook. And what Lean In truly means is that it's asking women to sit at the table, don't ask for permission, and to assert themselves in their career. And the book also has a collaborative or companion foundation, which is called Lean In. And so when I relocated to Dayton, Ohio, a few years back from Chicago, I wanted to explore what it was like to interview the women in leadership locally, because I had been working through my nonprofit, Women for Action, as an interviewer, interviewer, and I had been interviewing women throughout the country, um, in, in other countries. And so this was a new development for me. And so what I found was there was so many amazing women leaders throughout the state of Ohio. And I wanted to expand the project throughout the entire state. Lean in Ohio, 100 Women Archives, a keepsake of interviews with women trailblazers, volume one, consists of 33 interviews. So I've completed one third of the book's goal so far. Volume one consists of interviews throughout Dayton, Ohio, and also touches a bit on the Columbus area. And just a note, future interviews will expand to other cities. Each story brings you closer to the storyteller. The book reveals how they've climbed to their success, some of the challenges they face, and they also provide advice to anyone that wants to follow in their footsteps. So we're talking about leaders, movers and shakers in the nonprofit industry, education, legislation, and business. And to give you an example of some of these amazing women in the book, there's Yvette McGee Brown, which is the first African African American woman to serve as Supreme Court Justice for the state of Ohio. Colleen Ryan, the first woman commander of Wright Patterson Air Force Base, also president of Vectron Energy, which is the energy company for the state of Ohio. Mayor Nan Welly, she's the mayor of Dayton, and she's currently running for governor for the state of Ohio. There's also Sally Taylor three-time Emmy award-winning reporter, and Rhiannon Childs, who's the director of Women's March Ohio. There's so many more trailblazers in this book. This book is for academia, especially women, feminist, and gender studies programs. It's also for adolescent girls all the way up until women in their collegiate years. It's also for women early in their career to senior level. This book is a keepsake, especially if you live in the state of Ohio. Thank you for watching.